Hey you guys, welcome back to another video. This is the empty apartment tour. I'm just gonna show you guys what the apartment looks like really quick before I get moved in tomorrow. Y'all, this whole moving process and this week specifically has been a whole lot, a whole lot of, I barely made it y'all, I barely made it. I will catch y'all up on what's been going on in the vlog. Um, long story short, I'm recovering from being sick and I missed out on two days of packing, so I'm trying to get everything done last minute. So it's just a whole lot, a whole lot. But I got my keys today. So I wanted to show you guys what the new apartment looks like before I get everything moved in. But y'all, I'm just so, so thankful to have this new space. When I tell y'all, y'all don't even know the half of it as far as what was going on at my old place. It was messing with my mind, okay? <laughs> I'm just so ready. It's like being in the new space feels like a breath of fresh air, literally. I'm so happy to be here. So yeah, I'm just very, very grateful. Um, as far as the decorating process and buying furniture and all that, um, it's probably gonna be a little bit slower of a process than I thought because going into the new year, I have some financial goals that I want to tackle as far as paying off debt. And that for me is a priority. So buying furniture and all this stuff is on the back burner. Um, but it's gonna be a process. My goal is just to have my whole apartment furnished by the end of 2023. That's my goal. So um, yeah, I'm really excited to be like back in the home decor space because y'all know um, I stopped doing that at my old place because of all the stuff that was going on. And then at a certain point, I knew that I wasn't going to stay there anymore. So there wasn't any point in me trying to decorate. So yeah, I'm ready to get back on that home decor kick, honey. I'm so excited. So yeah, y'all, like I am not trying to keep up with the Joneses. Um, I can't afford to, okay? <laughs> we are on a budget over here. So yeah, I'm going to take my time, buy pieces as I get them decorate and bring y'all along the way. So let me go ahead and show y'all what the place is looking like. It'll probably be a quick five minute tour and I will catch y'all later. So here is what you see when you walk in. Here is the front door. And then off of the front door, you have the master bedroom. So you have a walk-in closet here. Okay with some built-in shelving here and some built-in shelving on this side as well. I feel like this is bigger. It's a little bigger than the closet that I have now. So that's what that looks like. And then when you walk out of the closet, you can walk into the master bath. And this whole place needs to be cleaned, honey, because uh, it's not giving clean to me. <laughs> it's not giving clean. But yeah, you see all that? Uh-uh. Nope. No, ma'am. But it is a garden tub. So that's what she's looking like. And we have the toilet area. And the cabinet area. And then more built-in shelving. And the bathroom as well. And then once you walk out of the bedroom... There is a closet here, coat closet, and it's pretty deep. So I'll probably end up putting all of my Christmas decorations in this closet here. And then we have the balcony area. So a nice size balcony, much bigger than the one I have now. It's covered. And then we have the living room area. So my plan is to put a sectional here in this area and this whole space will be the TV space. And then on this wall over here, do some kind of cabinet buffet situation. Maybe put my bar cart over here. And then of course, bar stools here and the dining room area over there. And it does have a nest thermostat which is cool. And then we have the kitchen. I'm so glad this unit came with stainless steel appliances because it makes the space look much brighter. Y'all remember when I toured this property, the one I toured had black appliances and the difference is night and day to me. This one is much better. So here is the kitchen. We have the sink. 
double sink. We have our cabinets. Lots and lots and lots and lots of cabinet space for all my stuff. So I am a happy camper, microwave, stove top. And yeah, and the fridge. And again, this is the dining area. I'm thinking that I wanna do either a round or oval table in this space. And I love the lighting. It's so much brighter than my old space. Y'all remember my old apartment did not have a light in the living room and this one does. So it's so much brighter in here, so much more natural light. And mind you, today is a nasty, gloomy day and it's still very, very bright in here. So I am a happy camper, y'all, because that was one of the reasons why I kind of um, fell off of filming at home because it just wasn't giving what I wanted it to give in my videos. So yeah, I'm happy. I can film to my heart's content. <laughs> and this is the living room area. It comes with a washer and dryer and I'm just gonna leave it. I was debating about whether or not I was gonna replace the ones that are in here with the ones that I already have. Even though these are older, I'm just gonna leave it because I don't want these to get damaged during the moving process and I would just rather just leave it alone. So my washer and dryer is gonna go to my mom and these are gonna stay in here. And we have some shelving at the top, shelving in the laundry room, but this is actually the pantry area. So that's the pantry. And we have a little bit of space. I can put stuff here and it's a little bit of space in there. And then once you come out of the laundry area, you have the guest or half bathroom and a spare bedroom, which is the den area. So here is the half bath. Hey y'all. <laughs> half bath area, pretty basic. And then this is the den area, which will be my office and guest bedroom. So it does have a built-in desk. I wasn't sure how I felt about it at first, but I do like it because this is gonna be my work from home setup area. And then once I get everything in here, I can still put a desk here for like my own content and personal use. And I can probably still fit some type of day bed over here. So yeah, that is what the new place looks like y'all. I hope you guys enjoy the empty apartment tour. Let me know what you think about it down below in the comments. Don't forget to like the video and I will see y'all in the next vlog.